Uh, all right, Austin, give me your list, bro. All right. Uh, at uh, 10, I have the Lakers. Okay. At 9, I have the Blazers. At 8, I have the Timberwolves. At 7, I have the Grizzlies. At 6, I got the Mavs. At 5, I got the Suns. At 4, oh, wait, I, I got to switch that. Okay, at 6, I have the Suns. At 5, I have the Mavs. That's on me. At four, I have the Pelicans. <laughs> oh, you see that? That's yeah. Yeah. Oh, that's crazy. Yeah. What's crazy about that? Yeah. Okay. Okay. Finish, finish your list. Finish your list. What's crazy? Hold on, hold on, hold on. No, I accidentally. No, I did it on accident. I really had the mask yeah. above them. Right. I did it on accident. Right. I that's why when I read that, I said no, that's wrong. All right. My name's Josh, and I did it on accident. All right. Yeah. Okay, bro. People keep are going. Weird. Keep going. <laughs> You're not no, done. Hell. My keep final going. list is Suns at six. People are weird. Okay. Okay. Keep going. All right. Pel's at four, and then Pelicans at four. Is that five? The Mavs are at five. Right. Bro, Mavs. please let him finish his Pelican's list. At four? Yeah. Yes. Bro, let him finish. Bro, say it again, let, bro. Keep, you keep getting interrupted. Say it again but with hey, confidence. Me having three Suns at the three is just Jake, hold on. Shit. Let him finish. Just three, I think two, the Pelicans one. are better than the Suns. Just three, two, one. one. And go. I also think you're an idiot. But three, two, hey. one. Go. Right, Who dude, is I need to stop the name. Well, I'm sorry, dude. No, you're good. I can take it. I mean, you're just c- telling 200 people that I'm a bitch, so it's kind of like. It's kind of wild. It's kind of wild. I mean. 200 people. We got 700K one time. Hey, I'm saying humble. All right, at 10, I have the Lakers. At 9, I have the Blazers. 8, I have the Timberwolves. 7, I have the Grizzlies. At 6, I have the Suns. At 5, I have the Mavs. At 4, I have the Pelicans. 3, I have the Nuggets. 2, I have the Warriors. And at 1, I have the Clippers. Hey, see, shout out Nuggets, 3 seed. Top 3 seed. Top 3, not 1. Yeah. (laughs) All right, so back to what you just said. Do you think the Pelicans are better than the Suns? Yeah, I do. Why? Because the Pelicans, their culture is right now is is on an upward is on like up and Zion last year I believe they have Zion last year they beat the Suns because they took them they took them on the ropes. Jose Alvarado is a great backup point guard. He's a defensive pest. He made Chris Paul look the worst like we've ever seen him. You have Herb Jones, who's a, an amazing defender. I think he can great be defender. In, I think he can be in contention for Defensive Player of the Year. Trey Murphy coming off the bench. Basically, they hit on all their picks last year. Like. Their one, their picks, all of them, they literally they smacked on. Trey Murphy is a he's a sharpshooter. He was not missing, and then Willie Green. I think he's I have him almost as head coach of the year because I think what he's going to do with that team next year is going to be. I think their the top four is like I think they have one of the best rosters in the NBA, and I'm high on Zion. And I don't know. I just I like what I like them better than the Suns all as a more complete team. I don't think there's any drama there like how the Suns have it. I th- I think I think Chris Paul's gonna like take a little take a little dip. See, that's, that's what that's what I inclines. like, or that's what I don't like is that people like to put that. I feel like there's not. Like, I didn't even mention like Brandon Ingram who's dropping forty stuff. a game in the playoffs. All right, we'll see. He is in, nice. his defense, I, in his defense, in his defense, I think the Pelicans' high is top is top being top five. I think that's, that's their, their high ceiling, and he, and he put them. He chose to go with that. That's in their ceiling. I'm saying. I didn't. That's their I didn't. ceiling. I'm not I would not be yet. surprised if they made the Western Conference Finals this year. Like that's how high I am see, on them. See, that's a high. That is a high. But he's going with it. <laughs> he's going with it. And there's nothing wrong ceiling. with it. His predictions. All right, but, <laughs> but hey, at least he's trying to. At least he's trying to explain it. I think the Pelicans have a better roster. I think the Pelicans have a better roster than them. Okay, but I don't. I feel like you. Why don't You've seen a ceiling of the Suns, which is. <laughs> finals, they're like not, they and are. they're not as good as that finals team anymore. Okay, but the, like they still can excel. They got at that the worst. Point. You still have the players. You still have Devin Booker, who just put up his best season last year. Okay, except for the playoffs, which he had a miss in the playoffs. Brandon Ingram, like he dropped forty in the playoffs, but he wasn't doing that when all it, season. When like, it when it mattered, when it mattered, okay, when it mattered. And now what I think and, realistically, what happened in that series is you caught an off guard Suns, and I don't think that happens again. I th- the Suns were too high off what they did the year before, and I feel like they took that into the last season, and that's why they didn't produce. And they got what have they done? They got what humbled, have they done to improve? What have they done to improve? What have they done to improve? CP three was not looking at Jose Alvarado before that, and I'm going to tell you why he just wasn't. And now when he comes into that, he's going to be prepared for Jose Alvarado. What's he going to do different? In the what's he going to do different? They won. They the, beat them because been they prepared that, for They them. shouldn't even been okay, in that, but in now that situation. Are, bro, they didn't, what I'm is, is they didn't even have their 27-point game score Zion Williamson in that. In and that, he's 100 that pounds lighter. Okay. I just and wanted I to bring that in. I, think I just wanted to bring that in. Got Mikel Bridges. Shout out Zion, man. Mikel he Bridges got B.I., bro. Brandon Ingram is a guy. I don't know where we I, – I know you. I'm going to remember this. I brought, I'm going to remember this to the I day don't I think, die. I don't think – You're weird about Brandon Ingram, man. I don't like that attitude. I like Brandon Ingram. I think he's no, okay. No, 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 no,
I just don't think he's as good as everyone makes him out to be. He is that so good. That's in my opinion. How good do you think he's going to be next year? I mean, I think he'll Tires. be. Tires. Thinking about it, I mean, I think he. Like points, how much do you think he's averaging next year? Oh, next year, probably like 20. That's, Tires. That's good. Tires, I know, I'm that's not going to lie to I'm you. I'm just saying people think like he's like. He'll be better. Like twenty, like there's gonna be better than that. Be like twenty four points. Tires, yeah, I'm not gonna lie to you, bro. He'll average like twenty four. I think he'll be. I think he'll do twenty. I think Zion's gonna do more in scoring this year, in my opinion. Tires, I'm not gonna lie yeah, to you. Yeah, but Bi's gonna be the number two. Yes, you just you pretty much def- defending me, and my sons. I very much appreciate it. But dude, Brandon Ingram is that guy. Okay. Time out. 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 Time what next year? Yeah, like twenty. Oh, so he's going two points lower than what he's averaging last season. So he goes from twenty three. Damn near. Be the number one so twenty two, twenty three. He's right? going to twenty. I mean, bro, Is he gonna they're, be the bro, he's the, bro, they're gonna be one A, one B. Okay, but he had twenty two last year, right? And he had to do all the scoring on a team that wasn't winning. No, he didn't. See, see, I was about to see. McCollum was there too, bro, and they were, he I was mean, still a, putting at the up, trade deadline. And he at was the trade yeah, deadline. Yeah, but he was still putting up those points towards the, even when he was there. Bro, McCollum, when you're looking at dude, when you're looking at it, yeah, if, if we're gonna sit here and say, bro, if Zion comes back, is he not gonna be the number bro, one? Bro, he could probably average the same amount of points, just average even more assists, cause Zion's gonna be dropping dropping another 20, 25. Bro, Don't I'm not even weird. gonna lie. Bro, I think CJ McCollum's right probably now. gonna be the number two next year. Who? Oh. CJ McCollum. No. no. Look up his stats. Dude, was so, he averaging more? No, see, bro, CJ's gonna be taking a leadership, a leadership Dude, yeah, role, CJ, bro. CJ's He's not better than Bi. He's not better Go than Bi. Go look at CJ though. McCollum's stats from last Hold year. Hold on, I'm butchering. I'm really butchering. Far off, right? Bro, CJ is not gonna. Dude, Brandon Ingram is. He's the second best scorer on that Good team. Either shout out either. Same wow. points, twenty two. It's the same amount. Twenty two. So think about it. Okay, I'm not that so crazy fine. To say the that. guy that's gonna take the the hit is gonna be CJ, bro. He's gonna take that leadership role, okay. bro. Bro. It's not, bro. Am I not right with that? He, uh, Zion is gonna take the scoring role. I think they're all three just gonna split it around even. Bro, then he's gonna have the same amount. He's not gonna excel I, that level. I, I you mean, guys think he? I is. mean, you're only helping my case. CJ is another twenty point per game score. That Suns don't have three twenty point per game. Not gonna lie, that starting five is pretty scary. That's what I'm saying. Is Herb gonna start? Hey, huh? yeah, starting five. So he's Herb's he's starting at the four. Uh, it would be because it, it. Oh it, no, actually well, no, because they got no. It's McCollum. B.I., Zion. It's Herbert. Herbert Herb Jones. Jones and then Valanciunas, yeah. no? Yeah. yeah. No, yeah. that's, pretty, who's the that's point a pretty guard? good starting spot. CJ. CJ. CJ played point guard for them last year. So who's the two? Brandon. Probably B.I. And, and then you got who's Herb Jones. Zion will Herb probably Jones. play. Zion and Zion Jonas. Zion will probably play the four. three and four. Who's five? And then Jonas. 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 That's a crazy starting five. It's a pretty five. good five. I'm not going to lie. It's a pretty good five. And I don't think that's that crazy for me having a four. And their bench is deep, too. You got Larry Nance Jr. coming off the bench. Who they just resigned? Jose Alvarado coming off the bench. Trey Murphy. Trey Murphy coming off the bench. Yeah, it's a scary team. Come on. For sure. But I mean, weird. Jackson Hayes too. But I mean, if you're betting on if Devontae you're Graham? if you're betting on their ceiling, then yeah, I Did mean, Jackson I, Hayes just get hurt. He's out right know. now. I don't know how long he's out for though. I, I think it said it was a long no, four ass time. Is four it? Weeks? Oh, okay, I thought it said four months. My bad. I I just literally just seen that come across my phone the other day. But see, he's on the he's on he's on the bench I though. I don't think. Look. Going back, look, going back to the conversation about teams, bro. I don't think he's that. I don't think he's crazy about talking about putting the Pelicans at four. That's it's just that's their high, in my opinion. That is their high being at four, and he's just running with it. You know what I'm saying? He's picking it up and sprinting, running hills and shit like that with them being at four. He's t- p- putting them in the predictions. I don't think it's that crazy to say. But I'm okay. gonna be safe. I'm gonna play it safe. I'm not putting them that high. But like, what's more likely to happen? Suns at three or Pelicans at four? Pelicans at four. Suns yeah. at three. Suns at three. Now, my, in my opinion, you, honestly. Uh, I'm not gonna lie. I think the Pelicans at four is can can happen. Yeah, Dude, yeah. Well, hold on. Why? If you're, betting, if, you're, if, you're bet, think, if you're betting on their ceiling, why do you not think the Suns at three? Because he don't like not, Devin Booker, bro. Not, like possible at all? No, no I mean I'm not saying it's not possible. I just, I really I just don't know if it's gonna happen, bro. What? I don't. But you think the Pelicans at four is gonna happen? I. If you're betting on their ceiling to happen, yeah, I, I think so. Dude, oh. I think I think they, that I think that team can be though? really scary, bro. What, what's I really about, think it's going to be scary. What don't you like about the Pelicans team? There's nothing you. There's everything on their team is great. Exactly, it's, it's good. You, you can't really but, point dude, out anything bad about things on the Suns is better. No, you can point out bad stuff on the Suns team. I can't really pu- point out bad stuff. And on this the Pelicans is one team. thing I forgot. Like I mentioned this um, prior before the pod. I like the Pelicans. I like Last the Pelicans. week, right? Last week, I brought it up. This is one thing that is even going to help the Pelicans. No one's really expecting to come in and make a big splash or come in and actually produce and win. 
That's what happened with the Grizzlies. The Grizzlies had a low-key good team all around and stuff like that. No one really predicted them or expected them to actually win. The Pel- it's the same situation for the Pelicans, but yet the Pelicans have an even much better team, in my opinion. They got a they got a big three. They got a Zion. They got Brandon, and they got CJ. That and is a big three. Did so you can yes. say a big forward, Jonas Valanciunas, too. You exactly, can yeah. Because he, he's capable of scoring 20 and 30 in a game. Like, that's the type of center he is. When you he probably gets, think Jonas Valanciunas is better than DeAndre. I mean, he you. averages 18, bro. It's close. It's not close. It is close. Dude, it's you're actually fucking close. stupid. I'm not going to lie. I like Valanciunas. I think Valanciunas is really D- Bro, D- okay. <laughs> DA is better. He's not even close to near DA. DA is better, but is, like bro. to say that it's not close, it's it's kind of close. Oh, no, I got you with Valanciunas DeAndre. Valanciunas is I was good, about to say, bro. Valanciunas is like, and I he's, think, and he's very scorer. And he's very good defensively, bro. I think Valanciunas is a way better scorer. I mean, he averages 18. So all this stuff, I mean, look, it's really not that. The difference is not that crazy. Look. I'm going to give you guys a Jonas. Jonas is 17.8, so we'll give him 18. Um, 11 rebounds and 3 assists, right? That's so Jonas. 18, 11, 3. DeAndre is 17, 10, and 1. So he better stats than him last He year. has better stats by like 1 or 2 in I each think category. I Eaton's better defensively, in my opinion. Maybe, but not by a lot. Oh, no, I think, I don't know. I think, I think Jonas defensively is pretty good, bro. I think, dude, that dude. scoring that wise, bro, they got crazy. it, bro, they got it. They got three, they got three twenty, a uh, plus twenty, on average in points. And CJ, Brandon, and Zion, you got a, you got a solid eighteen, like twenty, like eighteen to twenty points with Jonas, with Giannis or Giannis, Yo, Giannis. Jonas, 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 and you got a solid ten by her, bro. Like, I'll, I'll, you don't even straight. need Herb to score. You just need him. But to Herb, yeah, Herb, 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 exactly. Yeah, Herb's not there to score. He's there to play defense. Exactly, and he will bro. lock up. Bro, he's lock up. Yeah. Like no, he actually is. Like he's he will be on. I don't think he can guard any. I don't. I don't think you're that crazy. I just 